And as we head into the weekend, we have a story online about standing in line for 10 hours to get a hug. Ari Srinivasan explains. That experience comes from NewsHour political editor Christina Bellantoni. She writes of her encounter with Amma, a South Indian woman known as the Hugging Saint, who says she's embraced more than 32 million people worldwide. Plus, what it's like to shampoo in outer space. Astronaut Karen Nyberg demonstrates her hair raising experience in the zero gravity of the International Space Station. Watch that video on Lunch in the Lab. All that and more is on our website, newshour.pbs.org. Judy? And before we go, Hari, we want to tell our viewers about a big change coming up for both you and the News Hour. You are moving to New York to become the anchor of the new weekend editions of this program, which start in September. Very exciting. So tell us a little bit more about it. So half hour each day on Saturday and Sunday. Think of it basically as an extension of the news hour, natural evolution. We are committed to being everywhere, anywhere people want it, anytime people want it. So that means weekends and weekdays, online and on air. So get news hour seven days a week. And you will be appearing uh, here, right here on the news hour from time to time. That's right. I'm, I don't quit my day job, too. So really, it's just seven days of work now instead of three or four. As often as possible. We look forward to it. Thank you.